Hi, everyone, and welcome back to Micro Investor, where we do technical analysis, price predictions, and news updates on many different cryptocurrencies every single day. Now, in this video, we're going to be talking about Dogecoin and picking up where you left off in the previous Dogecoin video. So right now we're at a very key price for Dogecoin, which Dogecoin is working on trying to overtake the price of nine cents. And the important thing here is when you look at where Dogecoin was back in the middle of August, it was also attempting to break through that nine cent price and actually managed to hold support above it because nine cents was a very key price that Dogecoin had after there was a big sell off that had happened back in May of 2022. And then Dogecoin had managed to hold support at that nine cent price until it ended up falling through that. And that's what ended up taking us down to our 52 week low. So if we're able to break through this nine cent price and we could see something that could be very similar to like what we're seeing just recently when uh, Dogecoin had its uh, last rally that it had back at the end of the month of October. So if we're lucky, cross our fingers, maybe we might be able to see the price of Dogecoin have a little bit of momentum coming in. Of course, a lot of this is going to depend on what the market conditions are. Now, so far, I'm calling all these price movements that we've seen with Dogecoin since the 52-week low. I'm saying that was the start of our wave one. And this uh, recent price pump that we had, as much as we wanted to see that continue, of course, the FTX uh, situation had taken the price down. So I'm calling that all part of a wave one. We have come down in a wave two. And now we're within that process of taking off within a wave three so this wave three has a lot of potential which definitely is worth looking into about where things could be going but we'll get to that here in a minute let's first look at it how everything so far has been playing out since this whole ftx situation has really sent the price of dogecoin down so when we really started to rally up with dogecoin back at the uh third week of october we were seeing dogecoin's price go all the way up to around 16 cents just a little bit above 16 cents and then it had come down from there and we had come down within five waves. Now, depending on what on what exchange you're looking at, what exchange chart you're looking at, I should say, it's going to look a bit different. Now, I'm seeing we have completed the uh, fifth wave down from the whole FTX situation, and now we're working on seeing Dogecoin's price correct. At least this is what things are telling me. It's not telling me anything otherwise. So this is what I'm currently going with. So keep that in mind. There could still be a another price dip to uh, to happen here. But so far, I'm saying that we're looking at the possibility of seeing a Dogecoin completing its whole uh, downfall from that FTX fallout. Now it's in the process of correcting from that. Now, just prior to the whole FTX fallout, we were hoping for Dogecoin to be able to find stability at a price for around 10 cents if it was to come down within a wave two. Now, obviously things did go down much lower than we had wanted it to due to the FTX fallout. So a good key price for Dogecoin to get to would be if we're able to get back to the 618 Fibonacci level, that would be at a price that's just over 10 cents. So if we're able to get to a price between 10 cents and uh, 11 cents, that would be very, uh, very good if we are able to do that now. I'm hoping that we would be able to do this by the end of the month of November. And I know guarantees if that would be the case, but let's just put a box here and cross our fingers that things will manage to play out that way. And if it does, uh, that there might be a little bit more of a pump that we could be seeing too if we are able to get through this 50% Fibonacci level. So a price that would be up above 11 and a half cents. So if we're able to do that, then we probably have a good chance of seeing a little bit more of a rally take off here. Now, as far as things here with this wave three, now I think that there is a lot of potential here to not just retrace where we were at within the completion of this wave one, but also take this wave three up to a price that could be somewhere within the range of say, of say 24 cents or even more. So if we were to see this wave three uh, work its way up to a price that's within the range of 24, 25 cents, or even more than that, I'd say even 30 cents could be a possibility, then that would be absolutely amazing. That's my current price target for Dogecoin. Now, this will take us into uh, at, least the, um, at least the first quarter of 2023, possibly even into the beginning of the second quarter of 2023. So by the beginning of April, it could take for this wave three to complete. So, I mean, expect things to take a, take a bit of time here to actually work its way up. But I'm really hopeful that we might be able to see Dogecoin work its way up to at least a level that it was at within the uh, completion of the wave one. So say a price of 16 cents, possibly by the first week of January. And that is just all, of course, dependent on how the crypto market is going to roll out within the next year. 
So that's where I'm currently at. These are my current price targets. So I'm very hopeful that we'll be able to see the price of Dogecoin be able to find some, some more stability at a price that's around 10 cents within this next week. And then hopefully from there, we'll be able to see Dogecoin pump through this 50% Fibonacci level. So a price above 11 and a half cents. And that would be our best case of seeing this wave three really, really take off. But with that confirmation that we do need is we do need to see Dogecoin go above a price of 16 cents to get confirmation that we are in fact within this wave three. So we have a lot of work to do here to see this all play out. So uh, this is where I'm currently at with Dogecoin. I'd like to hear you guys' thoughts and opinions about this. Do you guys think that we could be seeing this, uh, the price of Dogecoin going to 10 cents within this next week? I would like to know. So with that being said, uh, please like, share, comment, subscribe. New content coming out all the time. I keep you guys updated daily with what goes on with Bitcoin and Ethereum. I talk about Dogecoin quite a bit and many other altcoins as well. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.